The Kern County Fair expects more than 400,000 attendees to walk through their grounds this year, and you can be sure each one of those fairgoers is expecting to see, taste, and experience something fun and exciting. And organizers have been hard at work to make sure that you get it. 17's Amber Frias joins us live from the fair with a preview of two new attractions that are happening today. Amber, how's it looking out there? What can you tell us? Lori, well, the fair has something for everyone, but it is also a place for friendly family fun. So before you all head down here with the kids, here is a preview of two new attractions that are fun for the whole family. Fair time also means fall time, and with that, everything pumpkin. We all can't wait till Halloween to do our pumpkin, you know. Russ Lano started carving pumpkins for his kids over 30 years ago. I've done some sand sculpting. I used to be on the U.S. snow sculpting team. Um, I've done wood, and but pumpkins just seem to be one of those things where everybody's just really interested in, and uh, it's just something I think we'd still do as uh, as people, as our, one of our last things we do at art. Three decades later, he still can't get enough of it. And this has taken me around the world carving, so it's pretty fun. And now he is making a living sculpting anything from enchanted castles to a portrait of the three little pigs. It's a hobby, and they actually pay me to do this. So it can't go wrong there. Leno has made a name for himself with his artwork. The reaction I get is like, wow, or, those pumpkins are so big. How do you do that? Well, you can find out how he does it at Casey's Farmhouse. Come out and look at the techniques of how, uh, how pumpkin carving can be done. And uh, maybe you'll get some inspiration to uh, carve yours this year. Picking up the adrenaline for the first time in over 20 years. Everybody loves to see the cars getting smashed and just the excitement of it all. It's a very family-oriented show. Everybody has a good time. A full-blown show complete with stacked cars, donuts, wheelies, and jumps. Everybody's come here to put on a good show. I'm looking forward to doing a great show since Cyclops hasn't been here since until 1987. Monster truck fans, buckle your seatbelts, literally, as you will be able to get in the middle of the action on top of fire truck, ride truck. You get to see the kids having a great time. I mean, they got a big smile when they're climbing up in there and a bigger smile when they're climbing back out. Now, let me tell you, being on top of this truck is definitely an experience you don't want to miss. I feel my adrenaline building and this truck isn't even running. So head down here. You still have time. The show starts at 730 and it's at the grandstand. Reporting live from the Kern County Fair, Amber Frias, 17 News. Lori, back to you.